The NSAS protest at Leki Gate entered its second day with a lot of Nigerian celebrities present. Some have accused Nigerian celebrities of wanting to hijack the protest. There are also growing concerns that if SAS is disbanded, robbery will increase. Nigerian rapper Jude Abaga, famously known as MI, has a different view. Um, look, we're, we're all with the people. Um, along the way, people are going to try things, you know, and uh, it's, it's almost like an open form of democracy in its own way, you know. Um, I remember yesterday, a few people wanted us to start marching from Murio Kanala Park. I think the spirit behind it was that uh, it'd be a shorter trip to the AIG's office. You know, we could go there, present a letter that was a response to what the president wanted, and then come back. Um, but when the people say no, we say no. You know, this is about the people. It's not about celebrities, it's not about leaders, it's about the people, the voice of the people. It's about the younger generation, you know what I mean? They're amazing. I'm just in awe being here, standing with them. I'm proud and like, you know, it's emotional sometimes. And so if, all I can say is that if, if in any way it seems like any celebrity, any of the celebrities are trying to hijack, we apologize. It's not intentional, it's because we're trying to help. You know, we will make mistakes, but keep talking to us. And we'll, you know, we'll step back in line when we step out of line. You know, to me, it's not even about just this protest. I think that so far, everything that we started out to get, the government has said that they'll do. It's about letting the world know, and letting the government know, and letting the older generations know we're tired. Time is up. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, this is something like we've never seen. Like the NSAR's uh, hashtag was 30 million. 30 million Everybody tweets or something. Um, <laughs> it, it was 30 million. Uh, then the new hashtag I saw yesterday was 11 million. People are so tired, you know, and it's not be, it will not be worse than what SARS will do to us. No matter how bad, uh, bad it is. I mean, there's all sorts of threats. Oh, they're going to, you know, uh, show us how it is without SARS. It's not worse than what has been happening to young people. It's not worse. It's not worse than that. And so... We, we can not accept it from our elected officials. It cannot be accepted, you know, so there's no debate there. What they're doing was wrong, it had to stop, end of story.